Yo, what is going on guys, Lights here, and we're going to be talking about the ultimate strategy to rank up to Master Prestige. Now, this is my strategy, this is what I used to get all the way to Max Prestige, and I did it in about five and a half game days, six days, and yeah, so let's go ahead and talk about it. So, this is what I and most of my friends who I play with have done, and this is why most of us are Max Prestige and or we just really high up there in the ranks. Now I, my friend Ryan, and Coco, Saint, we've all hit Max Prestige in a month of this game because we play a lot of hardcore domination, we've done camo challenges, we use a variety of specialists, we use just a variety of everything. If you are the type of person that gets attached to one type of gun, to one equipment, you don't use equipment, to one specialist, one set of score streaks, you're not going to be getting a lot of XP, and also you're not going to be getting a lot of XP if you only play free for all in TDM. So let's go ahead and get to the first tip. Make sure you're playing hardcore modes, more specifically hardcore dom. Hardcore dom is going to be giving you a bonus for every one hit kill that you get, and for most of the time, most kills will be a one shot kill. So that's pretty much a 75% bonus. Or 75 point bonus for every single kill. That's absolutely insane, guys. Absolutely insane. If you're playing Dom, you get a capture kill. That's 200 points plus the bonus. If you get a kill while defending, that's 125 plus the bonus. So that's 200 points right there. 275 if you are capturing. It's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. So make sure you're playing Hardcore Dom. Trust me. Trust me, trust me. A lot of you can be like, "You hardcore, no skill." D trust me. All right, so let's talk about the second tip. The second tip is going to be camo challenges. I know a lot of you have your favorite guns. A lot of you th is going to be like, "Lights, dark matter is a crazy accomplishment. Why do you want us all to do this? Because it's satisfying to have it. One, two, it's a great source of XP. Most of the time, if you go for gold on the gun, you won't rank that gun all the way up by the time. Camo challenges are so easy in this game, guys. And I have an entire playlist, an entire playlist with every single gun in it. If you need help, I'll link that down in the description. It's always there. And you can get your tips for each gun there. But going into this, you're not going to rank your gun all the way up to max level by the time you finish your gold challenges for it. And because of this, it's a good source because if you're using the gun to get headshots or long shots or whatever, you're getting levels for it. So you're getting XP, and then you're getting the headshot XP. You're getting the bloodthirsty XP. You're getting the gold XP. And when you do gold, you get diamond. You get 5,000 XP when you complete diamond. And it's just a crazy source of XP. So do that, and then obviously don't rank your gun all the way up uh, and prestige it until you get a gold. When you get a gold... If you want to use that gun again, use it, reset the, the prestige on it, and earn all that XP up again. Weapons are a viable source of XP, and it's a big one, so make sure you're using that. Specialist is another source. Every specialist has two challenges, as far as calling cards go. One, for 100 kills with the weapon. The second one, 100 kills while using the specialist ability. These are super, super easy to do. And if you're doing those, you stack your challenges with their specialist gear challenges. You need to get 800 kills with every single specialist in order to unlock their special sets. Every, you know, the first six sets are just 800 kills, and then you need to get 40 kills with the weapon, 20 kills with the ability, and then you need to do double kills. Well, if you're doing the 800 kills, you can easily get 100 kills with the weapons in that time frame. So do it. It's amazing XP, guys. Trust me. So to wrap up the video, make sure you guys are using a variety of equipment, wild cards, specialists, score streaks, weapons, go for different challenges, stack five or six different challenges, playing hardcore modes. Um, if you absolutely don't want to play hardcore modes, make sure you're playing different modes and doing the objectives for each of those modes. So make sure you're getting wins, make sure you're becoming top three in the, in the lobby. Uh, it just... Make sure you're doing that because if you are, you guys are going to be maximizing your total amount of XP. You guys are going to be able to prestige just as fast as I did. My friend Ryan or prestige and Coco and Noisy and just everybody that I play with Saint. You're going to be able to prestige as fast as we did. And until next time, guys, make sure you tell me what prestige you are down in the description or the comments down below. So I know you made it this far and you've watched the entirety of the video. 
Uh, leave a like on the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. Connect with me with my social media links in the description below. And until next time, guys, I'm Lights. Peace out. Have a great day.